Good morning and welcome back to the vlog. It has been so long since I've actually like filmed a video. Probably like a week and a half. So that's what we're doing today. I'm going to commit to the whole filming thing. Hi. So that is the plan. Today is Monday. It is January 22nd. I just got back from a walk with my dog in the freezing cold, so that was great. We are going to change clothes. I have a shirt underneath the shirt. Underneath. I'm literally wearing three layers of t-shirts and three layers of pants. I have one layer of socks though, so I don't know what to say about that. But we are going to change clothes and get ready for the day. I'm gonna take this off. I have something underneath, so, bam. I actually even have another layer under this. So today is Monday. Today is a very busy day, actually, because I have a doctor's appointment to go see someone about my headaches, which is great. Hopefully they can fix them. And I also have to go to a very, very late birthday dinner. Um, it is pretty much all of my friends 21st birthday at law school this month I think we had three birthdays four birthdays we had a lot of birthdays this month in January so my whole little friend group is going out to a Mexican restaurant tonight unfortunately however normally when I eat dinner I will eat dinner around like four normally five o'clock right when I get home and uh, we're eating dinner at seven today because two or three of the girls have a class that ends at seven so we're all just going to meet at this mexican restaurant and do that but other than that i only have one class to yeah i only have one class today it's at 10 30. it is currently nine o'clock on the dot so we have about 45 minutes to get ready and then we are going to head out okay we had to do a little location change because my dog was being a lunatic and she wanted to be in this room so now we're in this room as I was saying, it's my friend's birthday dinner, so we're going to this Mexican restaurant, so I guess I have to dress-ish okay. Although, they're just wearing stuff from class, so I'm not going to dress super nice, and it's also freezing outside. Do you want to say hi? No? Okay. That's fine. Whatever. Um, I have a hairbrush in here. Watching me. Chill out. Oh, ignore my clothes. I literally have all everything that was in my closet is now out of my closet and on my bed. So you can just ignore that. She's not happy right now because she knows that when I like brush my hair or change my clothes that I'm leaving the house most likely. And we already went for and we already went for a walk, so now she definitely knows. <laughs> so now, hey yo, don't mess with my pillows. That's why my bed never gets made, because she's just gonna mess it up. Who the heck makes her bed? Okay, Parpacore, you go. Um, but she knows that I'm getting ready to leave because we already went for a walk and I'm about to change clothes and I'm brushing my hair again. So she is about to start whining in about 15 minutes because she knows I'm gonna leave. Okay, next, I already ate breakfast. I made these little meal preps, like these egg frittata things. So I'm good on breakfast. I am gonna make lunch, but first I am going to change clothes. I'll be right back. All right, this is my outfit of the day. I got this shirt from somewhere at Short Pump Mall and these pants are from Amazon and that's my dog. So this is the outfit that I'm just gonna wear all day because it's super comfortable, but the girls are out, so. Next, we are going to make lunch. My kitchen is an absolute mess because I made rice last night, so I had to rearrange everything. So that my rice maker could fit. And technically lunch today is just going to be leftovers from dinner last night. 
We have lettuce, some rice that I made, and then these real good gluten-free chicken nuggets. 23 grams of protein per serving. Um, that's what we're having for lunch. It's more of a dinner, but I'm having a late dinner, so I need something really filling. And then we are also... I'm going to make some sauce for my chicken. I just scared myself for a second. That was terrifying. Um, we are going to make like homemade bang bang sauce. If you've ever had bang bang shrimp, this is pretty much what it is. I'm taking this Thai style sweet chili sauce, Food Lion brand. Calm down. And I have some sriracha mayonnaise that I'm almost out of. Technically, you're supposed to use like the Japanese mayonnaise and then add sriracha, but why do that when this is already made for you? And I'm almost out of this because I eat it with literally everything. I don't know how much that is, but about that much. And then I'm just gonna fill the rest up with this, ooh, chili stuff. I would say a good one to two ratio. One part sriracha mayonnaise, two parts the sweet chili chai. Sweet, you know what I mean. So that's what we're having with that. And then you just shake it up. And there you have it, homemade bang bang sauce. It is absolutely amazing. That's what we're having for lunch. I'm also, I made these little trail mix packs with like five different types of trail mix I have left over. So I'm gonna take one of those. I actually don't want that one. I want. I want this one. This is the one I'm taking. We have chocolate covered almonds, some regular trail mix, and then I have this Valentine's one that they had at Target. So we're putting that in my lunchbox. This is my little snack during class because I get bored. And I don't mean that in a bad way, but when someone is talking to you for over two hours, there's a point where you, you gotta rain back in. And for me, the way that I do that is messing with my hands. And so normally I'll have like, I don't know, I have a little fidget thing on my computer I'll mess with, or like, I'll open a bag of something, I'll eat something, like I'll regain my focus, but oh my god, two hours of you just straight lecturing at me is like, I just don't retain anything after about 45 minutes. Okay, I guess I'm ready to go. What time is it? I feel like I got done really early. I don't want to leave too early though. Hi, what you doing? Look how pretty my living room looks with all the sparkles. You can look out the window. Bye. Now she's gonna follow me. <laughs> All right. Deodorant, of course. I think I'm just gonna leave my hair down today. I don't do that often and it'll probably end up in the same stupid low messy bun, but that's just what I'm doing. Um, this perfume, I feel like we all know what this is. Okay, I need to find my phone and then we can go. All right, this is the outfit of the day. I have my big old Target jacket on in the outfit I showed you later. And I guess I'm just gonna go into school early so that I can come home early and do some homework. I have to read Wednesday and Friday for contracts and I need to finish up Crim Law um, and do some citations. So very exciting and I guess that's what we're gonna, that's what we're gonna do. That's what we're gonna do. Okay, bye, be good. I guess we're going to school now. You wanna go for a walk? You wanna go for a walk? All right, we are currently off on a walk. We're probably gonna do, I'd say an hour and a half. It's currently about three o'clock, so we're just gonna go until it gets dark. Um, 
I'm done with school. Where'd you go? I am done with school, had all of my classes. I'll do a debrief when I get home, but yeah, we're gonna go for a little walk. It is such a nice temperature outside. It's like 50 degrees, nice and sunny. So I'm gonna call my mom, do a little debrief, and yeah, that's the plan. All right, I'm back. I finished class and took my dog for a little walk. It is officially pitch black outside. So I'm going to get ready to go to dinner with my friends. I have not eaten anything except for a thing cottage cheese since like 12 o'clock. So I am definitely a little hungry. It is currently 6.25. I am planning on picking Laura up, my friend, at like 6.43 is the time that I told her because she lives just down the street from me. And the bar is not that far. It's so weird. I am officially the last one in the entire law school who cannot legally drink. Um, I am the youngest one at my law school. I am 20 years old. I started law school when I was 19. So a little wild, I know, little, not normal. Um, but it's definitely different. We're going, I'm gonna do my makeup while I talk. We're going to an Irish bar tonight, and I'm pretty sure I can get it. I'm not too worried about it. Um, blue eyeliner. I'm just going to put a little bit of this on. Can you still see me? Okay. Um, sorry, my dog is like underneath of me. Anyways, we are going to this Irish bar tonight because my friend wants to have a Guinness. Um, never had a Guinness, but I've heard they're kind of disgusting. So, don't know what to say about that. I don't know. Um, but at least that's what my mom told me. I had a friend, I had a, I had an acquaintance, a girl that I knew go to Ireland and they had Guinnesses and I was like, that looks nasty. And my mom was like, yeah, it's not great. So, I mean, to each his own, I guess, but that's where we're going. They have um, other food too. I don't know. I think I'm going to try a shepherd's pie. Maybe, I heard it has mashed potatoes involved and you know, I'm a sucker for some good mashed potatoes. So, anyways, let's talk about the important part, my day, of course. I had contracts today, which was long and slow, a little painful, um, so that was great. Um, after that, I had a CLE, which is pretty much like these continued learning things that we have to do. Um, at my law school, we have to do them three times a trimester. Um, this one was about interviewing skills and things like that. It was pretty informative, not amazing and entertaining, but it was fairly informative. And I mean, that's what I did during lunch. Then I had lunch with my friends and I caught up. Actually, I was ahead. I accidentally read a, read like almost a week ahead for crim law. So now I'm super ahead for crim law. Um, and I'm super ahead for contracts. So really I'm ahead for everything. I have a writing assignment due tomorrow and I haven't submitted that yet. So I think I'm gonna submit that when I get back tonight. This is pretty much done. I just need to finish up my citations. And yeah, honestly, that was my day. Um, what else exciting happened? Literally, that was all that happened. My mom's texting me. Oh, <laughs> she asked how my hand was. So I took my dog for a walk and my dog is absolutely amazing. Love her. She literally came absolutely perfect, except for the fact that I don't know if she doesn't like other dogs or she gets excited with them. Like, We'll just say she's very reactive. When we are walking her on the leash, she becomes very, very reactive to other dogs. And so I try to avoid them on our walks. We'll like turn around, face a different direction, things like that. So when I am walking, I was walking today. We were like two or three miles in. We're walking towards the house a couple, I would say a couple blocks away. And I see this lady with a pit bull and come like, we're like this to each other, but she's on a path below us. So mm, luckily Carnival doesn't see her, but the dog sees us and barks and Carnival loses her shit. Like starts pulling me this. She is a strong little pupper. She, she can pull me down. 
Anyways, she actually did pull me down and this is the first time recently over like the past week and a half We've gotten so much better with her reactivity and with her pulling and honestly her we her least I'm obviously had some anxiety her leash walking has gotten so much better and improved so much over the past like week um, but this was the first time I actually got like pulled down to the ground and I slipped on mud and like fell on the back of my like hip bone and like brushed my hand it was bleeding before it's much better now but that happened on our walk that was very exciting what are you doing okay I'm blocking this way, so she had to go around. Um, there's nothing underneath of me. What are you eating? Okay. Anyways, that is it. I'm literally just wearing the same outfit I wore to school to go, and I just reapplied to mascara and some blue eyeliner. Uh, you know, wearing some makeup today, spicing it up. I also have this little red spot on my nose, and I think it might be like old frostbite. I don't know. I think it's from the cold, and it like, is so annoying and obviously I have a little anxiety spot right there which is also very annoying probably cover that up I don't know what I'm anxious about I don't even feel anxious right. oh I'm sitting on this bench and she's trying to get like under parkour anyways that is the end of this part let's go to the bar I'm very excited I've never been here before Maybe I'll meet someone. Doubtful! Ha! Dude, what if somebody tried to buy me a drink and I was like, sorry. If you had seen my other vlog, you... <laughs> I once I went to a bar with um, my family and Barbara for like a concert and this creepy old man kept coming up to us and we had X's on our hands and we would be like this to him and then he ran away because he realized we weren't old. So... <laughs> Anyways, I am gonna head off to go meet up with my friends. Me and Laura just got a table for seven. We are the only ones here. off my makeup let's take off my makeup and recap what are you eating okay also i took her for a walk this morning and somebody dropped their biscotti and she tried to eat that stuff and what's up I just bought those. You know what? I don't care. No, don't. No, don't get under the covers. Dinner was good. Honestly, I had a really good time. It was like me and six other girls. We kind of just talked, chilled out. We were really the only ones there for a hot sec. So, I mean we could do whatever we want so it was really nice um yeah i don't really have anything else to say really we just kind of gossiped we were all in kind of the same cohort and then we all got separated so ever since then it's been kind of hard to like talk about certain things about certain people and topics and professors and things like that that's going on because you have such different ones so like comparing can be stressful because Everybody's learning something different and the comparison isn't fair, so. But anyways, yeah, that was pretty much it. Honestly, I had a really good time and the pub was really, really nice. Eliza was the only one who actually ordered anything to drink. And she got a Guinness, of course, because that's what she wanted. But I had a really good time. I'd go again, so. What's up, sweet pea? She's all calm now. You should have seen her 20 minutes ago. She was a freaking lunatic. Anyways. All right, guys, that is the end of this vlog. I, this vlog, I feel like, was very chaotic for me. I feel like I had a very chaotic day. But honestly, I was a pretty good day, I would say. 
Um, now I have to shower and get ready for bed. And that's it. Yeah, but that was my day. My first vlog with Carnival. She's underneath my legs right now. Where are you going? Come here. Oh my god. I feel like now's a good time to end the vlog before I actually break my camera. Anyways, thank you so much for watching and make sure to like and subscribe and comment and do whatever you do. I don't know. Um, and yeah, I will see you next time. Bye!